Hi, welcome to this lecture. This is going to be an interesting lecture because we are going to talk about the end-to-end -end process that is involved in implementing Hoshin Canary in Luca Corporation or for that matter in your own organization. The process, end-to-end -end process has two broad elements. One is about the Hoshin and the other is about the Canary process. As we described earlier, Hoshin is about deciding in which direction we have to go. Kanri on the other side is about making course corrections regularly in that process. So we will start with Hoshin and then move on to Kanri in the next few minutes. And by the end of this lecture, you will be able to appreciate how this end-to-end -end process is very different from the traditional process that we talked about earlier. As in any other strategic planning process, the first step of the process is environmental scanning. And environmental scanning is something that you might already be familiar with. Hence, I'm not going to talk about it in great detail. But essentially, the scanning starts with internal and external environment. When we talk about internal environment, we talk about things such as our employees, our financial status, etc., our process performance and all that. When we talk about external environment, we get into aspects such as political, economical, social, technological trends, regulatory trends, which could impact your organization. Based on this, we compile and if we already have a SWOT for your organization, then this can help us to understand in which direction we have to go. So this becomes the first step for any process. The second step is about setting the goals for the organization. Again, I'm not going to talk much about this area as well, because this is also an area or a topic that has been already you know, covered in many other courses. 